time you see this shirt, you know it's gonna be a good day, baby. Welcome back, boys! I hope you've gotten your phones out. I hope you've got your dialed in merch on. I hope you picked your phone up and dialed in! Because we got a big boy banger in store for you today. Coming off a hot W last week, we had Rage Quit Wheel Spins, we had Challenge Wheel Spins, we had it all. We've still got Kabash Gabagush, Vita Vea, Jonathan Allen, Clowny, Diggs, Ron Harmon. We're so stacked, we can hardly upgrade this team. Realistically, I could get a right tackle, I can add a little bit of wide receiver depth, and then I need a 90 overall kicker to get focused kicker, but dude, I really can't upgrade this team, it's that good. It is a good problem to have, Let's just say that. Jalen Hurts continues to play incredible. I'm pretty sure he had a QB rating of 140 plus last game. He barely missed passes. He had a touchdown. I don't get it. I, I like straight up, I don't get it. I'll play with 90 overall quarterbacks and they'll suck. Jalen Hurts is just out here slinging. It's actually, you know, it's gonna be sad. If I win in the Super Bowl, you know, my team is gonna reset. As much as I love Jalen Hurts, can I really prestige Jalen Hurts? I guess I could, but also we've got a whole season with this quarterback. We kind of want to try out something new. I might let you guys Decide. But that is a bridge that we can only cross if we get our wins in the playoffs right now. We're moving on to the divisional in the playoffs. That's our game for today. Our number one goal right now should be a focus kicker. All right, we're spinning the playoffs wheel. I don't really know how I'm going to get a focus kicker. I'd have to get pretty lucky with like... Oh, that is exactly how I get a focus kicker. And I was talking about Polymorph last time. Let's go. I can trade out 380 to 88 overall elites for 190 to 94. So I'm going to trade out Leonard Davis, trade out Corey Lindsley, won't get any reps anyway, and LaDainian Tomlinson, who literally won't touch the field either because we've got Cordero Patterson now. That's just too easy, bro. I'll probably go with Justin Tucker, although I don't think it actually matters. And I actually personally like Matt Prater better because Matt Prater, not only was he a lion, he didn't kick an NFL history game-winning field goal against my team. Kickers are expensive, bro, but I gotta do it. I got I got Cardinals, Matt Prater. Ask and you shall receive, I guess. Big clutch. And two things I wanna say. I would have like a crazy outfit on for this episode right now, because this is a big one, but I did ship a lot of my stuff off to Arizona already. In about a week here, I'm moving to Arizona. So say goodbye to our beautiful studio. Don't worry, I'm gonna build an awesome one there too. My long-term goal is to switch between this house and Arizona about five or six months each year. We'll have six months of bangers in Arizona, and then I'll read right back here, so don't worry. But a ton of my stuff, a ton of my stuff is in storage going there. Gucci Christmas robe, those goggles I was wearing before, maybe abuse pigs in there. I haven't seen that man's in so long. So just thought I'd let you guys know. Also, you'll probably only see one or two more wheel of in this studio. Just thought I'd let you guys know. All right, first wheel spin, amazing. I gotta get him in and make sure I activate that ability. Hey, great start. All right, boys, Matt Prater's headed into the lineup as we're getting our second wheel spin. A elite right tackle, like a really good right right tackle would be best case scenario here. It's gonna be top 10 guess age. Okay, the odds we get a right tackle here might not be that high. And I also would then have to guess their age to get them. I'm gonna go sort the entire auction house by overall. And out of those 10, the first 10 that I see, I can take any player, but I have to guess their age correctly. All right, boys, when I hit X here, it's gonna be sorted by descending. So it should be all of the highest overalls currently on the auction house. Three, two, one, this is big. This is big. Brady Moss, okay. Okay, I got juice. Uh, Clay's Campbell, that could be good too. John Mackey, I guess would be okay. Deron Harmon, I already have you. Calvin Johnson actually could be good. I do need wide receiver depth and Jerry Rice. Okay, lots of good options. But I, dude, I don't know how old Randy Moss is right now. He's gotta be old as shit. He can't be older than 50. He can't be younger than 35. I'm gonna say he's 42. He's 44. Randy Moss is 44. Okay, so that's an L. Kyle Juicy Juice, bro. I have the 85 overall. I actually would love the 93. That'd be hysterical, dude. He's been in the league a while. I have to imagine he's getting older, but he can't be so old that he's still playing. I'm gonna say 30 on the money, because I feel like you get any older than that, you just don't even want to be playing football anymore. Age 30 years, April 23rd, 1991. Has that happened yet? Is that accurate? April? No, it hasn't. He's 30. You know what? I really don't want an upgraded fullback right now, but he's kind of a stud. I will take it. If I can't get anything else, I'll take it. Megatron. I feel like he's got to be like 39, 40, 41. I'm going to say he's 38. He might not even be 38. He could still be playing football damn near. He's 36. Calais Campbell. He's old too, bro. I'm going to say Calais Campbell is 32. Holy shit, he's old too. Jay Rice has gotta be like 60 now. I have no clue. I'm gonna say, I'm gonna say 59. Holy shit! Holy shit! <laughs> He's 59!
October 13th, 1962. So he just turned 59 too. Oh my God, that's hilarious. So I could take Jerry Rice or Kyle Juicy Juice. I feel like depth wise, Jerry Rice makes more sense. But what are, what are your stats? Are you that cracked? He has 91 speed. Terry McLaurin is way faster than Terry McLaurin. Let's go Jerry Rice. I think this is the best play. DK Metcalf, AJ Brown, and Jerry Rice. We have two of the best young wide receivers in the NFL. Actually, three if you add Terry McLaurin. We got three of the best, and then we got this 59-year-old bum. Who even is Jerry Rice? Like, does anybody know who that is? I don't even know who that... I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Settle down. Don't un unwrite that comment. I'm kidding. All right, our challenge wheel, which came up clutch last time too. So let's see if we can get another one here. It's gonna be hat trick. Oh, yeah. <laughs> this one's awesome. I've never got to use it yet. 40 fantasy points with one player. Full PPR is how I'm gonna be tracking this. So if you don't play fantasy football, I'm sure what I'm saying doesn't make a lot of sense, but in fantasy football, your players are gonna earn points. Duh. For every reception, I get a point. For every yard that player gets, divide by 10, and that's a point. If they have 10 receptions, the player has 10 points. If they have 10 receptions and 100 yards, that's 10 more points for the yards. That's 20 points. And then touchdowns count for exactly what touchdowns count. So if one player has two touchdowns, 10 receptions, and 100 yards, that's 32. Point being, somebody has to seriously go off to get 40 fantasy points. Ooh, we're in so far. It's his Super Bowl. We're playing in a Super Bowl. We got the coin toss. Ooh, we're kicking off. Let's go. This three-letter abbreviation is WOM. Maybe I'm being a little cocky, but I'm pretty sure WOM means wheel of mud. All right, hey, defense wins championships. Honestly, defense is pretty much the only reason I'm in the position I'm in right now. So let's stick with it. Gagaba Ghoul is on the QB spy. And he appears to be doing a good job at it. He's doing a great job at it. We're going to keep that QB spy on. He goes with a run. It's baseline. Okay, good. Oh, throw this. Oh, that's sketchy. No, he's not in bounds. He's not in bounds. Fourth and two in the Super Bowl. From his own 35 in the Super Bowl. All right, let's play underneath. Stay disciplined. Stay disciplined. Throw here. Oh, did he get that? I respect it. That was really impressive. We're just going to QB contain. Just play base coverage. Ooh, that dig is open across the middle. Not anymore. Go get him. And I'm on this. What are you doing? I'm all over that. He said, is this Papa? It is, my son. It is. Second and 20 in the Super Bowl. Nope. Ooh, slip screen. Get swatted down by Jadevi and Clowney. All right, let's stay in the contains. Good looks, everyone. Fully covered. Go get him. Fourth and 18. Impeccable defense. Oh, no. I have to make an adjustment. Playmaker. Oh, get there! Let's go! Great stop! Huge! We got the ball on the 30 in the Super Bowl. I don't know who's gonna get this challenge. If we're gonna complete it, I have to imagine it'd be Derrick Henry. I'll probably try and feed Derrick Henry this whole game and just see how it goes. And I can't imagine it'll go poorly because he's such a fucking freak. Hopefully he follows Metcalf here. That's the goal. Let's see if he does. He does. And we're gonna get the pass off. Great throw. Get in the end zone. Let's go. I don't know what he just did there. He just squatted down. I think I meant to dive. Either way, it's a reception, a touchdown, and passing yards. Huge play right there. This is the playoffs. We don't take our foot off the gas in the playoffs. We keep pumping. So let's go. Let's hit the edge. Let's get through. Oh my God, he got lit up, but he still got it. Two point conversion is five. Touchdown is six. Reception is one. He's at 12. Ed Reed, you're going to be the cutie spy in case he rolls out left. Oh, okay. Okay. Yes, sir. I'm all over that. Reach for it. Nice play. TJ Watt, QB spy. Good. Let's just play coverage. Ooh, okay. It's about to be 16 to zero. Let's get that edge one more time with Derrick Henry. Oh my God, did we get it again? Two more fantasy points, baby. All right, nothing there, nothing there. He's looking for the scramble, it's not there. Absolutely disgusting. This could be a run, I'm blitzing hard. Ooh. I'll make another one with Henry. Fourth and seven. Let's see if he goes with. Nothing's there. Nothing's going. Big stop! Ramsey's got it! And we're off to the races! Good stop and go. Ooh, and we just get tackled by an offensive lineman. But we're at the 50. Let's see if he'll bite. I want to throw Henry one more time. Yeah, bite on Waller. Bite on Waller. 
Yes, sir. And you know Jalen Hurts is going to deliver this pass, and I'm just going to get around you. <laughs> no way am I going to go for a touchdown. Air truck! Big truck! Oh, my God! He's that guy! I have to prestige Derrick Henry. Don't I have to prestige Derrick Henry at this point? He has loaded up the left side. He's expecting the stretch. Look at how unbelievably wide open this is. This has got to be there. Ooh, he ran commit, but it's Derrick Henry, buddy. This Derrick Henry is as good as the Bo Jackson from three years ago. I might have to send this guy the dialed in merch for free, despite the fact that he's not dialed in. <laughs> it looks like. <laughs> Holy shit, he broke through Jalen Ramsey. Just like that, he's got points. I would just like to say it's never supposed to be this easy to do the challenge. Derrick Henry's just going fucking ballistic. All right, first and 10, let's see if Derrick Henry's open for one final time. And I am actually gonna double team the side here. I would love some time to throw this. Oh, sketchy, just kidding. Why am I saying sketchy? That's such a lazy. I am pretty sure Derrick Henry has gotten the challenge already. Let's try and send him right up the middle and uh, see if it's there. Blocks set. Gotta go for two again. Derrick Henry right up the middle. He is gonna, dude, I actually feel bad. He's 32 to seven. Have I ever scored this many points? I'm on pace for 64. This is a Super Bowl. High dig is not there. Who just caught that? And Joku's having the day of his life. I am shocked by this call though. Oh my God, throw that Jalen! Oh, Jerry Rice's first attempted reception. That's actually so sad. The first time he has a shot, it goes nowhere. He's pulled his linebacker out of there too, so that makes our job <laughs> really fucking easy. Let's see if we can uh, dial this up. There goes Henry. I think he's gonna get it. Does he see it? Does he see it? He does not. And if he does, he's too late. Oh, go through him. Go. Oh, fuck. sketchy. Fuck, 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 Jaylen. fuck, Jaylen. fuck. Jaylen. Oh. I'm only mad about that because it puts Jalen Hurts' QB rating down. I dare you to throw this, bro. He just user playmakered a halfback slip screen. I've never seen that my whole life. I just blitzed just about everybody, but we've got him tackled. Go get him. Ooh, nice play. I'm gonna go double QB spies here, just so that middle's locked up, even if I'm not there. And that should be, that was an insane stroke of luck. However, doesn't really change the title of this game. Let's see if he floats to it. He's too late if he's gonna stop and go. Hi, I'm on my way. I'm recording a banger wheel of right now. It's gonna be a super heater. I'll be there. Very nice. All right. Wheel of my dub, cheek clap. Woo! Gonna be a good day, baby. Geek zone bubble. Do you smell it? Do you smell it? Oh my God, I smell it. I smell it. I smell it. Geek zone bubble. That's guaranteed 40 now. All right, let's see if Henry dusts his man in the middle. Uh, he actually, are you gonna go to the end zone? Well, it's an absolute guarantee now. Well, luckily he's a subscriber. Hopefully he sees this video and then goes and uh, understands that I have to get fantasy points here. Also, I have four for four on two points. Oh no, Beckham Jr.'s got it. He's got a bit of a Browns theme team, I just realized. Njoku, Odell. What a game! 40 to 26. Hey, shout out Ace here. Hey, thanks, thanks for watching, bro. You're a stud. I love you. Also, thank you for the easiest double of my life. You're so bad. It's a, I'm just kidding. Your ass, literally so free, literally free. Dude, let's look at the game stats. Jalen Hurts does outperform Vince Young. Vince Young had a bomb free touchdown there at the end and Jalen Hurts had an INT because I was only throwing to Derrick Henry. Still had an amazing game. Three touchdowns, one interception because he's Jalen Hurts, baby. Zeke was seven for 19, but the king, King Henry, five for 39, average 7.8 per game and receiving. That doesn't get you horny, dude. Just don't talk to me. I think, I think I got 40 points straight off receiving. I don't even need the rushing touchdown or the two point conversions. Let's tally it up. 11 points for 11 receptions. 21 points for 211 yards. Holy shit, that is literally 32 right there. And three touchdowns is 18 points. That is a 50 bomb in fantasy. So 50 plus four points 
for the yards here is 54, plus a touchdown is 60, plus four two-point conversions is 68! 68 fantasy points out of Derrick Henry. One second, I think we might have just beaten NFL record. Number one is Jerry Rice on the 49ers. He dropped 52.5 in one game, and we just dropped 60. So, for completing our challenge, we get one of any pack that we choose in the store. Before, I was going for vets, but that's because I was trying to get Matt Prater. Heavyweights, there is a right tackle, Rob Havenstein. He is the best pull from heavyweight. So, it'd be really rare. He's a 91, but he is a right tackle. There's also a right guard, a left guard, and there's Taylor Moten. Another, there's actually a damn good chance. Let's go for the 89 plus heavyweight players. Good chance at getting an O-lineman. I want a right tackle. What are the odds, baby? What are the odds? Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh my God, I'm on that. I got Montez Sweat again. There was a point in time where I could have bought Montez Sweat instead of Clowney. We really needed a right tackle right there. It's all good. We're playing amazing. We have two more wheel spins in the next episode just to get right tackle. And honestly, I don't even need a right tackle. That's just for shits and gigs. So I got nothing to complain about. Awesome game. Locked in another W. Jalen Hurts continues to be quarterback of the year. I might have to prestige him. Next game is the conference championship. NFC, FC, call it whatever you want. But it will be a banger just like this was. 13 to 8 in our first one. 40 to 26 in our divisional. All right, boys. I love you. Thanks for watching as always. I will see you in the next episode. Peace out.